Flight Simulator Center and Project Magenta have been closely cooperating for several years now. The ambition is to create and expand the current line of realistic and reliable flight simulation products. The most recent milestone has been the introduction of dynamic control loading for the B737 device with a graphic user interface to set and adjust the different functions of the flight control's response. Right now, the system controls the pitch and bank channels of the yokes in our turnkey simulators. Two brushless motors and pistons with a ball recirculating warm gear work on the yokes to provide an accurate pitch and bank feedback. A CAN bus communication interfaces the motors with the server, where a dedicated driver regulates the feedback. The drivers are programmed to be the most realistic possible. So here we are in the simulator now, and um, we just made some tests with turbulence and the autopilot engaged. If we now commence a turn, and also with the descent at the same time, so either maintaining the altitude or turning is going to be handled by this control loading. Once the autopilot is disconnected, I have control, but I will have to then use the trim to help me maintain a particular attitude of flight. So switching off the hydraulics will have an effect on the, how hard the flight controls are. And the pilot will have to use more force to control the flight controls. Professional airline pilots collaborate with us to tune and calibrate the software according to the real aircraft. Simple and reliable. The next step will be to release the control loading channels for the rudder pedals and the tillers. The active control loading enables the flight itself to interact with the pilot for an even more involving experience. Each flight is a new thrilling experience. <laughs>